With the bulldozers and cranes in motion, the digging and hauling wood going on at the Denver Zoo, animals like the elephants and tapers will soon have a new place to call home. We gear up to walk through the Asian Tropics exhibit that right now is a construction zone. But you can see it taking shape as we walk into one of the five habitats and check out a 25-foot shade structure. So an elephant would come in here just to get out of the sun? Sure, relax. yeah. These guys are working in one of the pools. This is what it will look like. You'll be able to stand on the boardwalk over what looks like one body of water, but with underwater borders. You can see that there's walls that are built, but they're underwater which will make sure that the gibbons stay where we want the gibbons. And other animals are where they're supposed to be. Check out this bridge. When the outpost area is done, you'll get to see elephants, rhinos, or tapers walk the bridge as they move from one habitat to the next. Obviously, there's a lot of construction going on right now with all the heavy metal work. And a little behind the scenes in this building where there will be five rhino stalls, including two with pools. It's such an aquatic animal, and we want them to have the opportunity to get some of their weight off of them. So they'll be able to get actually into an indoor pool while they're in here. Which means they can get a water workout any time of the year and get natural sun with skylights. Or you can catch them outside in one of these heated pools. The animals will be here a few months before Asian Tropics opens to the public. To get the animals in, have the animals get acclimated, learn where they can go, what their shifting patterns is. And it'll give zookeepers operating the facility time to get comfortable in the exhibit, including working with some of the more unusual animals that will call the Asian Tropics home. We have flying fox, which is a bat species with over a five foot wingspan. Fishing cats, which to me, the fishing cats are going to be so cool. It's one of the few cat species that really gets into water. And we'll have the opportunity to, uh, for the guests to put fish into the pool that they'll actually hunt and fish for. 